Silent Hill, the short message, fear will take you. This title contains depictions of suicide, self-harm, abuse, trauma, and bullying. Damn, bro, just, just checking everything off. <laughs> Holy fuck. Some people might find it distressing. The makers do not attend whatsoever to encourage or make light of self-harm and suicide. Damn, what the fuck happened? This game has a suicide hotline. What the fuck's gonna happen? If you feel like you are at risk of suicide and self-harm, please seek medical help. That's my life, yeah. <laughs> For real. That's me every day. <laughs> that's that's me. <laughs> yeah, convince. I think I heard it's two hours long. If you feel that you are at risk of... Okay, we get it. I, I'm not suicidal. Okay, only on Sundays. Seeking a connection with others is a sign of weakness. It's running away. The strongest animal. Yeah, if it does it again, TJ, I'll pause it and, and fix it. It should be good, though. Alone. And need only themselves to survive. Those who betray themselves to fit into a group are pathetic. Damn, pathetic? You gotta call me like that? You gotta call me out like that? There's no beauty in living like that. I want to be strong on my own. Without a group. If there were only someone who would understand that to adult me. This is the main character, huh? This is who we are? What's her name? I wonder if that person that died there probably died from suicide, eh? Probably what, like, the whole story's about. For real, mainland. Oh. Wait, is this the graphics of the game? Is this the graphics? Oh, it is. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna shit my pants. I wanna show you something. Can you come to the villa? Yo, this is literally PT. What the fuck? This is literally PT. Amelia says, Amelia, are you all right? You asleep? You still asleep? Sorry, I woke you up. Didn't see you at your job yesterday. Still not feeling good? You taking your meds? No respond from Amelia. I wanna show you something to come to the villa. We got Maya and Amelia. Uh, No notes yet. Notes are probably gonna help me with like puzzles. Maya and Amelia. Okay, okay, good, okay. What does this say? Uh, thief, welcome to the city of no hope. Notes, plan to rebuild. Oh, okay. So the notes section is like collectibles. The plan to rebuild, kettle stand, and overview. The theme is re revitalization. Revitalization. Ooh, it failed the second time to rebuild. Everyone's losing their futures. Hey, yo. Escaped the system. Where are you, Maya? Honestly, Maya, like, you're on your own. You know what I'm saying, chat? Like, I'm not, like, you're on your fucking own. I, I'm going home. <laughs> I'm going fucking home. <laughs> Hell yeah, I'm going to play Nana Jones. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The keynote, like, I walk into this area here. Maya, you're, I'm going home. What do you got in there? Got some flowers in the fridge? No exit. It's not, that's not a good sign. Session flyer. Provincial meeting. All Villa residents, you have received many inquiries about the management of this building. After the recent news, we would therefore like to hold a meeting to explain our policies more formally. We hope you could find the time to attend. Hey, I didn't close it. You fixed this damn door! All right, all right, fine, ghost. Close the door on me then. Close it on me. Close it on me then. We'll repaint it all. Did Maya do this? CB. Cherry Blossom. Oh, Maya did make it. Maya's signature. Jeez. Yeah, the dolls. I'm, I'm trying to wonder about the dolls too. Is it like a... Amazing. It's not a doll factory because it's a building complex. Okay, that's Maya. I want to show the hidden side of girls. Their impulses. Their urges. Kind of. Got to got to know the age first. <laughs> Dude, the graphics are insane. What are you hiding inside? That looks real. That has to be real. You know what I mean? That's like, there's no way that was graph that was graphics. How could I ever be proud of myself? Everyone can see how talented she is. I couldn't be more different. The doll head. Who's there? Sorry, sorry for the reply. I fell asleep. Don't worry about it. How are you feeling? I'm okay. I can actually kind of get some rest now. Didn't mean to scare you or anything. Seriously, don't worry about it. It's all good now. I'm still a little tired, but I'm going to get tired. I'm going to get up soon. Huh. That 
Okay. So she's good. Amelia's good. All right. <laughs> Dark Agent. Oh, what the fuck? Insane, loser, crazy, loser, crybaby, creep, liar. The fuck? Am I reading my Twitter mentions? <laughs> Yeah, Antonio's. <laughs> she never said anything nice. Jesus. Looks like she lost her mind. Holy crap. She filled her apartment with it. Child abuse and neglect in Kedinstan. A recent a recent statistical survey has shown the rate of child abuse in Kedinstan last year was nearly double that of the average in other developed nations in Europe. The recent economics... Uh, economic... God, the recent econom economic strife is its resulting poverty are thought to be the cause. My mom loved me. She's gross, dumb, stupid, stupid liar, stupid, creepy. You'll never become anything. You are wasting your time. Are you dumb? What? <laughs> You're delusional. Hey, that one's for me. That one's for me for sure. You're delusional. That one's for me. Yep, that's me. Oh my God. What the fuck's he, what's, what's a her? What's a her? You're a nobody. I want to, I want, I want to know what a her means. <laughs> Freak. Quit whining. Get out. Man, shut your bitch ass up. Like, bro, this is what you have to deal with? Close your laptop. Turn your computer off. This is the brunt of it? This is like the average Call of Duty lobby. Like, <laughs> Ugh. Oh, it's a razor. <laughs> bro, just go outside. <laughs> yeah, Maya's got to clean her bathroom for real. What do you want? I'm so tired, but I'm gonna get up soon. What about me? What about Anita? What? You didn't look so hot the other day. That's kind of mean, bitch. Like, what kind of what kind of rude shit is that? I was having a bad day. Okay, I didn't put makeup on. I'm fine. You don't have to worry about me. Okay. Well, obviously I'm gonna. I'm taking my meds. Meds are good, but what about your therapy? That, that really doesn't do much, to be honest. Take, talking to adults doesn't help. Some of the, our classmates were hospitalized. You don't have to do this alone. Wait, some of our classmates were hospitalized. It was like a wide school thing. I know. I'll let you know if I need anything. And those guys deserved it. Huh? They feel bad. You know all of them. We're going, there's some mystery happened. Some sort of mystery happened. School shooting, I'm thinking of school shooting too, yeah. Maya? Hello, Maya? Who the f- You- You're not Maya! Get me the fuck out of here. Get me the fuck out of here. Get me the fuck out of here. Get me 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 out of here. Open up, open up, open up. Get me out of here. That is not Maya. I'm jumping out the window. You know, I'm like, I'm out of here. F fourth floor, fifth floor, I don't care. I'm out. I'm out of here. Maya, you guys may explain it to you. Maya, that wasn't you. I'm in the studio. No, you aren't. No, you're not. Maya, there's a fucking demon here. There's a monster here. See, I, I knew it. That thing might still be here. Jump out the window, right, chat? Like, get out of here. Teenage suicide continues in infamous building. Wait, infamous building? Suicides uh, continue in this building. A rundown apartment complex in Kenstad has become known for its suicides when, with teenage girls jumping from its roof every year. Despite repeat events, the building abandoned ever since the development management company declared bankru bankruptcy remained easily accessible. The young and unemployed are not deterred by the building's grim reputation, though with many continuing to enter it and young graffiti artists using it for their work. Meanwhile, local resident security concerns continue to grow. This is like a known suicide building. Oh, look, it's that, silent, it's that Silent Hill, classic Silent Hill fog, huh? I'm surprised there's no, like, Easter eggs out there, you know what I mean? Could you imagine you see, like, someone in the window? That'd be creepy as fuck. Imagine that. Someone just staring at you in the window. Oh, another one of Maya's drawings. <laughs> so, um, I'm guessing she's speaking Japanese. That's why it doesn't match the mouth. Because it makes sense. Cause Silent Hill, right? I think it's made by Jap Japanese. I think it's made in Japan. They bloom beautiful. They fall beautiful. That's how I want my life to be. You can have that, Maya. You can have your life like that, okay? You can have your life like that. Why is she not replying? Come on. I have to find her. Just maybe, maybe, maybe leave the suicidal building. Maybe that. Maybe don't stay here, you know? Monster. It's gone, right? Where is the studio? 
This looks like a studio. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, that's the that's the suicide spot where they drop where they drop from, inside the fog of social media. Solitude and anxiety in teenagers. All the teenagers interviewed said they were ashamed of risky selfies and they posted online. They also claimed to experience anxiety over not getting the likes and such photos. What all the great kids had in common was extremely so uh, low self esteem. The greater the anxiety, the lower the confidence. The more pronounced their reactions were to positive attention. The sense of fulfillment. The experience after getting a like online is difficult for adults to comprehend. Ah, that's why that's why Antonio posts a bunch of fake fucking news constantly. He needs that validation. I got it. Just a thought, you know. Creepy. I. I hope you're all right. <laughs> they, they feel bad. You know all of them. By the way, thought any more about college? I can't do it. You don't have to decide right now. So, once you're in college, are you not coming back here? No way, I'll come back occasionally. My parents would give me shit if I didn't come back, come home for breaks. But yeah, just give college some more thought, okay? I told you, I can't go, it's not for me. Studying isn't my thing. I told you, it would help you. It's fine, I can't do anything, okay? Don't know what I'd do if I got in. That's not true. You're way too hard on yourself. Be proud of who you are. Wait, what about those drawings you showed me? You could you could audit an art class and it could lead to a job. I'm not my, okay? I'm gonna be a YouTuber and a Twitch streamer, <laughs> Amelia. Stop asking me about college. Mealy just doesn't get it. Gotcha. So he don't really like this place. The Silent Hill 2 remake is going to be so good. I know, compare, especially if the graphics are going to look like this. People in this, town this game is this game is giving me PT vibes. Well... Whatever the whatever they're saying about you, Maya, it's definitely not. They're definitely not talking shit about your paintings, that's for sure. Because you're a good painter. And as long as I'm with you, I can have fun anywhere. There's no way out. Whatever else she did on her own, that's on that's on her. CB. Oh, this is this is her, this is her apartment because she she tagged it. Is this your studio? Yes, sir. Sure is. Are these Maya sketches? These aren't even finished. And they look this good. They yeah, you know what I mean? Like, they're definitely jealous of Maya. How are they talking shit about her? They're jealous they can't draw. New life. So full of life. Oh, did she have, she had a crush on someone. Are you here? Where are you? This place is dangerous. We need to go. Maya, please respond. Skizibuch is German for everything. Why? Why is it? What, so what's it mean? See, I'm so glad I got translators in the chat. Am I going crazy? Mai is definitely the monster. I think so too. Oh, oh my God. Okay. That the way that cloth, the the physics on that cloth was really cool. It, it's it's translation for like book of sketches. Oh, okay. Vince thinks that she's taking all the girls there to talk shit about her to make this to make them commit suicide. Oh, that might be that would be a crazy twist. That's a nice theory. And she's like the monster there. Or or the girls aren't actually killing themselves and Maya's throwing them off. Oh, I see. So she never posted sexy pictures, but they were they were making fun of her because she wasn't. And they were telling her they should. She should post sexy pics. So they were like bullying her to, sh to post more scandalous pictures. That's what it was for sure. I'm so sorry. No, I, I 
shouldn't have gotten mad like that. I can't tell if we're dealing with like our own trauma. I guess I haven't <laughs> accepted Maya's death yet. Yeah, it's definitely it's definitely a representation. Wait. Huh? Maya's death? Why did she jump from the villa? Why did she have to die? That Maya's She's a monster. Dead? Wait. Maya's really dead? Uh, how? How could I forget that? Oh, I'm probably dealing with the trauma of her death and I'm and I'm not accepting it. Yeah, it's it's definitely a representation of trauma for Find sure. It. You're right. You got it. You hit. You know the convince. <laughs> Maya doing swanton bombs off the roof. <laughs> you well find it. How about no, Maya? How about I just go home? I don't want to fucking find it. Uh, um. Okay, get me out of here. Get me out of here. Oh, oh open it. <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> my heart, bro, my heart jumped. <laughs> oh, I don't have to turn around. I just I went right in front of it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got hiccups. Yeah, I got hiccups, definitely. Yeah. Bro, my diaper. <laughs> my adult diaper. <laughs> It, from from what I saw, it looked like it was Maya with like st sticky notes all over her face. I'll have to pause it when I when I look at the footage, but that's what it looked like. Even more followers. It looked like Maya in a dress, with like sticky notes all over. No one is ever going to notice me. Oh my God! Is she gonna kill herself? Don't do it. She's gonna hit the swan thumb bomb. Maybe I can be like her. Modern day. Here goes. Hey, maybe maybe there's a hay bale down there, you know, like Assassin's Creed. <laughs> she <laughs> she does the jump party day. Oh my god, she did! Ah, oh, she 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 didn't even swanton bomb it, bro. Amelia, Amelia, Amelia. Again, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. Is that it? Wait, it's a loop? Am I back at the villa? Oh, is it a, is it a loop? But why didn't I die? Cause this is how the game started, remember? Oh shit. Imagine she can't die. Bruh. You find it? You find what? Can't leave till you find it. Oh, I'm like I'm like stuck in like a, like an eternal loop this really you maya can't leave till you find it maya's dead and you're not her can't leave till you find it who the fuck is this can't leave till you find it i'm blocking you bitch tell me i'm blocking her like that's how you get blocked instantly oh great my battery now i'm in the dark yeah for a second i thought the game was over there i was like damn that's so short as fuck so i wonder what do we got to find That light was not moving before. Bad girl gets an empty plate. I don't, I don't think that was on the... Yeah, that definitely wasn't on the fridge last time. Oh my god, it's so dark. It's all your fault. Bro, my, our main character, Anita, I think her name is. She must have done something. She must have done something. Because remember she said that the boys deserve it. Oh, the painting's all fucked up now. What? Bitch, slut, it's all your fault. Loser, ugly, freak. Oh, that's creepy to look at. The moment you turn the corner, did you see that staring at you? 
Uh, you guys hear that crying and shit? Mm, I don't like this. The doors are closing by himself. Give me that knife. Give me the knife. Let me hold the knife in my hand. Let me hold the knife in my hand at least. <laughs> oh. Wait. It's back on. The phone is back. Dude, I can't wait till Silent Hill 2 remake him up. How could somebody do this? Finish my masterpiece. This is great. Your work really... Oh, I, I can't control it. You're so full of yourself. What is this shit? <laughs> Here we go. More more people messed up views. Your art sucks. Worst shit I've ever saw. Fuck you. <laughs> nice art, bitch. <laughs> oh. Um, just gonna pass by here. <clears throat> just gonna pass by. Thank you. For <laughs> my diaper, dude. My dad. So Amelie and my I'm talking to. I'm Anita. Just like before. Oh, they're repeating it. You feeling okay? He's gonna repeat the same thing. Good enough to get out of bed, yeah. So am I really dead? Why are you asking that? Please tell me. Oh, split personality? Imagine that. Because she did say... Uh, my character did say I'm not taking meds anymore, so... I still can't believe she's gone either. Wish it was a lie. She seemed perfectly fine before it happened. So Maya really is dead then, yeah? Anita, are you okay? Are you getting enough sleep? Anita, Matt's win. <laughs> kind of. I'm taking some really good meds. Oh, I guess I am taking meds. Meds are good, but what about therapy? Oh, she's repeating it again. You're so good to me. Maya really didn't tell you anything. No, all she talked about was a book she read recently. Still, I feel guilty for what happened. Even if she didn't tell me anything, I should have known something was up. Oh, maybe... Really maybe it was that book I looked at. Like, at all? Maybe it was that book I looked at. Remember earlier? Think of the, book. the author killed themselves. When they were young. Something... Beautiful from something tragic. It's kind of enchanting, isn't it? Not really. I wonder what they were thinking right before they died. Anyway, I didn't think you'd share your thoughts in a letter. You really are shy, aren't Look you? Look at all the notes in the back. All the post-it notes. I actually, kind of like that, though. Wait, did we have a crush on her? Maybe we had a crush on her. We wrote her a love letter. I can't wait to read more. Hey, yo, you gotta... Nah, never do that again, please. That that scared me. Don't, never do that again, please. You're getting blocked again. I'm blocking you again. You look at me like that, you're getting blocked. Oh. <laughs> Sticky notes that we want, Cody. That was not hot. That, that, that gave me a little poopy, you know what I'm saying? I'm ready to the next scene. Sign me up. If you want food, do what I say. Damn, just like me, for real. <laughs> in Japanese culture, there has been a long sense of beauty and sacrifice with harakari. Oh, yeah, I know harakari. Yeah, the Japanese used to do that, right? Slicing their stomach with the, with the sword. Yeah. Taking your own life, you uh, symbolically purge the world of your trans trans transgressions and purify yourself. Modern, modern Japanese people, however, do not view suicide in such a positive light anymore. And the life they value is not a biological variety, but rather a social one where death is needed to protect a life. What is this new? I need about to pull up the mist. She's giving me ring girl vibes. Fortune telling? A lot of people are getting into that. Huh? You don't believe in that stuff? Well, I think there's something real about it. My great grandmother. Yeah, I'm letting the, letting her know you're blocked. Okay. <laughs> I hear people here used to treat her like some sort of prophet. But they all eventually turned on my great grandmother. Guess you can predict other people's futures. Yeah, I mean it's 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 not the greatest outcome, but shit, would you would you rather how we currently had it, you know what I mean? I mean, they should just give the one-on-one, to be honest, but this is the best way to rectify it, honestly. Oh, here are the cards. Tarot cards. <laughs> no point predicting my future. The star, the, the star, what the fuck did I say? The hermit? That'd be me for sure. The chariot, M? Oh, no, sorry, that's a, 
XI, so 21. I usually want to learn how to read tarot cards one day. This is all your fault, everything. You're a heartless bitch. You stole my only friend and place in this world, all of it. You don't even care, I'm invisible to you. I fucking hate you. You're not talented, you're not special. You call those shit stains art. You came out of nowhere, ruined everything. Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. <laughs> the fuck out of my life you piece of shit freak what a what a lovely love letter i well thank you thank you that is the kindest thing you've ever 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 had thank you thank you for saying that to me appreciate it so kind it's like a regular tuesday night for me no medical uh dutchland medical university school of medicine it's for the college amelie wants to go to Oh, Amelie, what do you want, Amelie? Hey, Nita, you got a minute to talk? Not really. Sure, what's up? You seem kind of out of it before. If something's bothering you, I can let me know. You can let me know. Thanks, but I'm fine. Sorry to bring it up. Don't want to pry. Now it's okay. I don't mind. Hey, we should go shopping sometime together. I haven't left my house in it feels like forever. Plus, my brother's coming here. Oh, right. You okay? Yeah, I'm just going to try and avoid him as much as possible. So shopping, yeah? We could find you something cute. No, nah, I'm good. I'm not a fan of crowds. Nothing looks cute on me anyway. Jeez, I'm miserable. I'm fucking miserable. Yeah, she's pronounced Amili, Amili. Yeah, exactly. Stop talking like that. You're way too hard on yourself. You got books. You got the looks. You just need to find the right outfit. Too hard on myself. Huh? Amelie's the only one who thinks that. That's, terif that's terrifying. Why would you want that in your room? Why would you want this in your room? December 23rd, 2020. Okay, so it takes place in 2020, possibly. Or 2021. Or maybe modern day, actually. I haven't been able to study since my brother came back from Christmas break. He's nice and doesn't interrupt my studies or anything, but I can't stand him staring at me. I know he was probably just messing with me back then, but I've been scared of him ever since. It's made me hate any guy looking at me. I can't believe other girls walk around school and town showing so much skin. 20 February 21, 2021. I think I'm finally finding my study group. My test scores are really good. I'm worried about how much my parents are fighting recently, though. They were yelling at each other again. Today, I asked my mom why, but she wouldn't say. May 11, 2021. This is it. Test day tomorrow. Mom told me I should be proud of myself since I work so hard, so I'm feeling great. She's not my real mom, but I know she loves me and I love her. Mom, I'm going to ace this test tomorrow tomorrow for both you and dad. So we got a stepmom. Oh, this is a Millie's room. Yes, because of the uh, acceptance medical thing. Yeah. Stud stay home alone. Is a Millie dead as well? This does not seem like an apartment that's been used. August 24th, 2021. I got some materials from the first choice in the mail today. I'm going to be college freshman. I'm so happy. I still can't believe it. Mom, dad, I'm going to study my ass up and be the best daughter ever. Thank you so much for everything. Uh, mom and dad are yelling at each other again. They're talking over bankruptcy. Wasn't even supposed to work out even without the rebuilding plan. So this means they're out of money, right? Does that mean I can't go to college? All that hard work for nothing? No way. Don't leave me, mom. I can't stay here. I can't be stuck here with my brother. What did the brother do? Mom just left. She told me to get out of the way. I have to get out of here. I want to disappear. But what, but where would I go? This is all a bad dream. This is all a bad dream. This is all a bad dream. I think they're all dead. I think they're all dead. I think my, our character is just talking to ghosts. Young student found dead. Possible suicide. Oh. At around 10 a.m. 24th, a local resident reported seeing an 18-year-old female high school student fall from the roof of the Kettle Stand apartment building. The girl was rushed to the hospital but was pronounced dead two hours later. According to school staff, the girl was distraught over not being able to attend college due to trouble at home. Her police believe her death was suicide. What the fuck is going on? That has, that's definitely a, a Millie. I think if I pull an all-nighter, I'm finally focused on my studies. It won't be good for my skin. I can just hear people calling me troll and nerd, but I don't care. I have to make the college city. Mom and dad are counting on me to do well. I'll make them proud by getting to my first choice. All right, time to hit the book. Oh, COVID. That was talking today about how there was a plan to rebuild town. They were going to use a bunch of funding from China to turn the town into something better, but everything got canceled due to COVID. Sure, it would have been nice if it had gone through, but I just couldn't see it happening. Even if things had worked out, not in this place. It hasn't been special since I was little. There's nothing to do. These buildings are ancient. It's a dump. My future isn't here. And it's in the city where college life is waiting for me. Amelie hated the way her brother looked at her. What? Like, I bet she wants to leave. So I will. I would love to know what the fuck the brother did. I'll be like, I'll be honest. <laughs> Why would they call her troll? Okay, where do we go now? That's trash room. Uh, have I gone down here yet? Oh, I guess not. Hey, what the hell? Is that a, is that, is that the school? Oh, are we going to finally see what happened? Yeah, actually, you're right. You're right. Good good guess. It might be the stepbrother. Yeah, it might be a stepbrother. Because the mother is a stepmother. Witch locker. Yeah, is this is this place located in, in Germany or Austria? That'd be, that'd be a great idea. Especially because since he's just healing, you know what I mean? And I would feel like he's not gone, you know? Oh, okay. Really? That's kind of mean. My shoe. Go away! Ow. Damn, how hated am I? What the fuck? Witch. Freak. No wonder nobody likes you at school. <laughs> oh, that's my locker. Huh. So I also was an artist?
But well, maybe Maya was like the better artist of the two. <laughs> it feels like a bully simulator. Yo, this is a bully simulator. What the fuck? Dude, like, I'm getting bullied. Like, literally. I'm playing a game just to get bullied. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. Shit. I'll shut it up. Fuck. <laughs> the re <laughs> Yo, this bully remake is crazy. Rockstar really outdid them really outdid themselves this time. Like bitch, close your eyes, you know? <laughs> Leave school. <laughs> like that's like the equivalent of like turn your computer off. Just close your eyes. <laughs> oh yeah, they are talking about Maya. Okay, they are talking about Maya. So it's like I'm experiencing through Maya. It's like I'm experiencing Maya's life before she killed herself. Cut off all your senses. <laughs> oh, not again. Oh, shit. Not Here again. again. Not again. Yo, let me run! Oh, no, I hate this. Fuck me. Stupid bitch! Oh my god. Why are you chasing me? My heart. My heart. Not again. Not again. It says don't run. Yeah, I know right. What did I do to deserve Dude, what did my character do? For real. Oh, here we go. I find find it. Find what? What do you want to fucking find? Tell me what I'm looking for. Find it. Man, this bitch no help! What the fuck am I supposed to Actually no fucking help. Pregnancy test positive. Ooh. Oh! You were going around. You were going around, Maya. Uh-huh. You got booked. That's the guy. Starting to click. She was a slut. <laughs> going. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> oh, maybe Maya got with Amelia's brother. What you see? Come closer then. Wait a sec. You two are from my class. Those glasses look good on you. So the guy? Who's the girl? Uh, sorry, she's so cute. I couldn't help myself. What? Oh, we. You're free to stop by any time. You're what? Welcome. We had a thing. Then how'd she get pregnant? She was bi. She had to have been bi. Only ever cared about Amelie. Oh, that was Amelie. Okay, that was Amelie. That was my character. Okay. Oh shit! So Maya and Amelie had a thing. It was invisible to her. Then how'd she get pregnant? Yeah, so that was Amelie's stepbrother. Yo, you might have you might have nailed it on the head. She got with Amelie's stepbrother. Oh my god, you nailed it, bro. Are you sure you didn't fucking spoil this up for you already? Uh, tried to lose myself in the graffiti, but I wasn't feeling it. Maybe it's because mom and I argued this morning. Probably not. We've clashed before. I've known for a long time. We value different things. It's because my classmate teased me. I doubt it. They don't know me. They're just taking their issues out on someone. It's gotta be because I lost a special person and I hope you gave me right. Why do I feel like this? Never felt like this before. So this is my guess, Chad. This is my guess. My guess is that she got with Amelie's boyfriend, um, brother. She got with Amelie's brother and Amelie called her a slut and started calling her names and spreading it around school. That's my guess. It was Amelie's fault. And my character didn't have Maya's back. No, I believe you, Chris. I believe you. I'm just, I'm just joking around that because you're nailing it. You know what I mean? Oh, what the fuck? That's a good graphics. finished it so it's all yours 
This has to be like Unreal Engine 5 or something. This is crazy graphics. I wrote my impressions in a letter. Read it when you get home, okay? It's probably the day she killed herself. She kind of looked like she was done. Ain't no way they did the business on that old dusty mattress. <laughs> Pretty sure the mattress was cleaned by then, okay, before the building got abandoned. Where was it? That book. This scene right here, if I just took a picture right here, that looks just crazy graphics right here. That's actually insane. Kettledstan, the town cursed by a witch. Oh, it is German. It is German. Okay. The economy is in shambles and once blooming industri industrial city has failed to revitalize itself twice. Uh, miscarriages are also at 31% more. Double the average. Damn, so this place is definitely cursed. Why me? Why do I have to be cursed like this? Find it. Tell me, is this your curse? Find it. Find what in a place like this? I still wait for you. I still wait for you. It's the I still wait for you collection. It's in the locker. No way. It's in the locker. Holy waste of sticky notes. It's like that other school. Why does this always happen? Never seen like that yeah, it's, it reminds of PT as well. You can definitely tell that this became PT. Like the next Silent Hill game is gonna be like what PT was supposed to be. You're right, Nita. You left me. You left me on red, so I was worried. Sorry, what's just thinking about Maya? Not sure if you know this, but Maya was bullied at school. I know. Yeah, because you probably you you did the bullying. I guarantee it. But she said she was okay. I figured I shouldn't push the issue. Then it was a little too late. Why didn't you say anything before she died? I wish she talked to me. Maybe she didn't see me as a friend. Ooh, yeah, probably because you bullied her. <laughs> It was me, Anita. It was me all along. I wonder why they called her witch, though. Maya's locker. No, it's not here. It wasn't here before either. Wasn't? I swear it was. What? Oh, Amelie's, Amelie's locker. Yes, it's just a novel. Wait a sec. It started to add up. Proper cream. Damn, girl, why you got cream in your? This press conference is gonna be great. Something I don't want to see. How am I supposed to know what this is? Now we gotta find the lock. Oh uh, shit! Nothing here. Nothing here. So we only have these two lockers to work with. Oh, one. There's a one there. Yeah, yeah. I just saw it too. Yeah. So one there. You said there's a zero as well near the water fountain, right? Oh, two for sure, for sure. Where is that zero you saw? Oh, yes, on the door. Okay. So we got a zero there. So I wonder if the order is from where I entered. So one, two, one, two, some, or sorry, one, a zero, one, something, and then ends with two. So I got to find like a number in the middle point. You know what I mean? Three. Okay. So we have zero, three, zero, three, one, two. Try that out. Zero, three, one, two. Try that out. Zero, three, one, two. Ooh! And I can't look away. Nothing like solving a puzzle. Gives you that dopamine hit. <laughs> Is it the book? Mom, 16, something, something. March 10, report deadline. Oh yeah, mail in, yeah. It's a great feeling too. This, this must be the letter that she gave her and said, read it. Gave me they took him to away. Huh. Ah. This is this is our locker. This is this is my locker, I believe. Or it's it's either my locker or it's Amelie's locker. I'm assuming it's Amelie's because it's the letter we got from Maya, but Amelie. I keep calling her Amelie. Amelie. Oh shit. Looks like Anita was very very territorial over her friend. She wanted to take her down a bit. She she 
she was taking Amelie away from me. She wouldn't pay attention to me. Am I the bully? I'm the fucking bully, aren't I? How was I supposed to know she had I'm the fucking bully. I was the I was the one. It's all your fault. Yeah, makes sense now. <laughs> Bitch is right behind me. She's right behind me. Open up, open up. I hear her clanking her legs. Oh, I'm a guy. <gasps> what the fuck? <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? Let me get out of here. Okay, up here. Oh my god. My heart. Bro sweat, yeah. <laughs> so I'm a fucking asshole. I just so I'm the one that bullied. Oh, it is my fault. I kept the book away from her. I was afraid she'd take you away from me. My mom was right. I should never have been born. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah. Anita, you're a piece of shit. You're a piece of shit, Anita. Get the fuck out of here. How dare you do that to your friend? Get her out of here. Oh, thank you for the message for the fifth time. Appreciate thank it. Thank you. Don't feel the same. <laughs> Ooh, her eyes went red. What? Yeah, she is like, you are not gonna die. You're not getting the easy way out, bitch. I jumped off the building. I'm gonna torture you. I guarantee that. That's probably what it is, huh? She's probably torturing her. Oh. Huh? Oh, damn. Even if I die, this doesn't end. How many times do I have to go through this? Find it. How can I get you to forgive me? Please, Maya, tell me. Please! Why won't you say anything? February 4th, I ended up heading to the roof of the villa. Couldn't help but think of the girl who jumped to her death last year. Actually, a lot of girls killed themselves here. All teens, supposedly. Now the place is famous spot for people to kill themselves. Looking down from the roof, I could see how high I was. The thought of the light breeze sending me flying made me feel a little queasy. Were they not scared? What was going through their heads? Were they jumping away from something or to something? Don't you dare go outside. Now I said something different. And this place is open. This area is open now. Staff only. She has to find a way to cope with it. Yeah, that, 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 that could be what she has to find. Yeah. No hope. The Silent Hill phenomenon. Ooh, finally got the word. We finally got the name Silent Hill dropped. The suicide rate has increased around the world in large part due to the struggles brought on by COVID-19 pandemic, with countries still unsure how best to handle the issue. These uh, trying times have also given rise to a strange phenomenon. In many areas, those affected suddenly claim to see fog, even unfair weather days, and lose consciousness shortly after. This has come to be known as the Silent Hill phenomenon, namely named after a similar event that occurred in an, in an um, eponymous US town. The first to propose a theory explaining why this could be happening is Dr. XXX, a social psychologist and XXX at XXX University. It's a fucking porn university or something? Who had the following to say on the matter. To one who is psycho uh, psychologically unstable, fog represents uncertainty and sensory illusions. 
When in a state of high stress, one vision may become foggy, I guess, yeah. Obscured or tunneled, as if one is wandering through a dense fog or mist. Soci societal uncertainty is or app apprehension about the future manifests as fog, thus blurring the lines between illusion and reality. As time goes on, we are seeing more and more cases of the Silent Hill phenomenon. In response, Dr. Triple X calls for rapid rebuilding of society as well as a stronger emphasis on counseling and mental health care for the young. Oh, honestly, you know what? I just I just completely understood why it's called Silent Hill now too. She's applying for X and X X. Hey, yo, mainland. No hope. Yo, your mom kinda, you know? Your mom's kinda. At least this shit clean now, right? Uh, diary of a single mother. I finally lost touch with him. I'll never see him again. I thought I'd found my happily ever after, but it was still all a dream. <laughs> Bitch has no reflection. She a vampire. I had to double take the picture of the mom. Pizza from Pizza Planet. <laughs> I wonder if it's better than your pizza, Moody. My new man showed up to my place today with pizza. Children definitely need a father, but they still won't, but they still won't take, talk to him. But they still won't take to him. He looked annoyed when he left. I hope he doesn't hate me. My daughter drew a picture of our family. We're smiling and holding hands. I wish she would have drawn him as well. Maybe she doesn't realize he might join our family. She is slower than other kids her age. <laughs> hey, yo. I'm sure she'll catch up and pass them soon enough. I know how to raise a child. I'm a good mother. I'm nothing like the heartless bitch who raised me. I won't fill my children with hate and fear. Mm, you know, well, call, calling your child slow probably isn't a good start. What are we drinking? Budweiser. What a yucky beer. Literally, literally water. Bro, so I go back to the picture. How tall I am, dude. Oh, am I fucking short as shit? He showed up again with a smile on his face and a pizza in his hands with the new place he was raving about. My daughter hated the pizza though. Yeah, because it wasn't Moody's pizza. That's why. She's extremely picky. I should probably teach her to eat things she doesn't like. I know I was forced to eat things I hated when I was a kid, but I guess it has to be done. The kids finally blew up in front of him today. He was exhausted from work and said he just wanted to relax. He makes me feel so good, but I can't do the same for him. Maybe I'm not strict enough with them. We need we need him for a happy life, and I need him to realize that I know uh, that I know it's probably a little harsh, but maybe if they don't see the light for a while, they'll finally see the light in him. He told me the banging on the closet door was making it hard for him to unwind. If that would just be quiet, if they would just be quiet for a little bit, everything would be fine. What's wrong with them? He doesn't visit as much as he used to. If I don't figure something out, I may never see him again. Wait, he told me the banging on the closet door was making it hard for him to unwind. Did they lock us in the closet? Okay, I'm, I'm clearly missing another message. Yeah, they're on the cheap stuff. And yeah, the daughter did, did deserve better. Turn page, probably. Oh, next. There we go. Oh, no, that's no, that was it. Oh, here we go. Whoa. Eh, the mom was banging the pizza guy. I mean, theoretically, she was. Everything seems to be going well. We we're going on dates. He was worried about my kids, so he brought them a bunch of books and toys. That should be enough to keep them occupied, right? I've been going out so much lately that I left the place in a bit of a mess. I should clean it, but by the time I get back, I have no energy. I got contacted by the Child Welfare Center. I guess a nosy bitch or asshole in my building reported here a child crying at night at my place. The fuck do I do? The fuck do they know? He hasn't called me much lately. Am I destined to be alone? Maybe the bitch clean your apartment. Maybe that. Everyone knows. Everyone else is out enjoying life while I'm working my ass off raising kids. Why am I the fucking bad guy? If I hadn't had children, maybe I'd be planning my summer vacation with my friends right now. Nothing matters anymore. I'm just crawling through life. I know what's going on in the closet, but I can't look. Wait, I know what's going on in the closet, but I can't look? I just want to be happy. What's wrong with that? I'm done. The fuck is going on in the closet? Average AW fan apartment. Miss Krista Planert. We have reached to you repeatedly, but you have yet to receive a response. We take this to mean have no, we take this to mean you have no intention of remedi remedying this issue. You are in violation of the German Civil Code, Article 1631, Section 2. Accordingly, the federal court has instructed us to take your children. What's going on in the closet? Boy found dead in the refrigerator. Mother arrested. Oh my god. The boy was found dead in the refrigerator in the home of his 41-year-old mother, Person A, who was arrested by local authorities for hiding the body. Person A claims to have locked her son in the closet for more than a day to punish him. And when she noticed he wasn't moving the next day, she hid his lifeless body in the refrigerator. Investigators are conducting an autopsy to determine the cause of death. According to the investigation, Person A's daughter ran to a neighbor's house to call the police and report her mother for neglect. When detectives arrived at the house, they discovered her brother's body in the refrigerator and arrested the mother. What the fuck is this? Oh my god, that took a massively dark turn. Massive dark turn. Maybe this- I think the kid's uh, starved. That's my guess. So... Oh, I see. So all this was told to Anita, our character. 
So our character has like massive trauma too. Oh yeah, we see Nikino already. I trust him. Jesus. So I'm the curse. Please don't leave me. Oh, and that creature is our mother. That monster is our mother. Oh my god, okay. So it's like it's like I'm constantly dealing with my own trauma. <laughs> right, yeah, I'm glad I have a loving mother. <laughs> So the mother killed the brother, the mother killed her son, and our character killed our killed one of our best friends. Well, indirectly. Why am I seeing this room here in the villa? I tried so hard to forget this place. Oh, for a second I thought that was the body. <laughs> I was like, yo. <laughs> yeah, so so it looks like the pizza guy, the stepdad, locked the son in the closet, and the mother because the son was too loud, and the mother didn't do anything about it. Oh, I'm dead. Damn it, first death. Was I supposed to die? Oh, maybe I was supposed to die. I'm sorry, Mom. Oh, no, I wasn't. Okay. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's a pretty cool way to like play on the, the on the death in the game. Whoa, you saw the phone? He started laughing. Oh, it, it did it did show the phone. Okay, so it does want me to go to that door. Oh, I see, I see. I gotta get all the all the pictures. Shit, I hate when games do this. I hate being chased by a monster while I gotta grab stuff. Oh, oh, no, God, just keep, God. Just keep fucking flying, bro. No, God, keep fucking please, flying, bro. No. Where are the damn collectibles? Me too. I hate I hate chases as well. That <laughs> maybe when it maybe when it sh flickers like that, I'm in the right area. Fuck, man! It's right behind me. That bitch is right behind me. Fuck! This is co so confusing. I'm so lost. I'll be dead ass. Apparently, they might add it. <gasps> oh, there it is. Okay. It is it is flickering when I go here. I feel like it's it's in this bathroom right here. God damn. Oh shit. All right. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to do this in one sitting, aren't I? Like if I die, I gotta grab all the collectibles again. Okay, room room two ten. Okay, here we go. Two ten. Two ten. All right, that's a new room. This is a new room. Oh fuck! Oh, what the fuck, bro? <laughs> the bathroom again. God damn it! This fucking bathroom again. It, you know, it would help if I could actually like look around. Yes. One more. Two more. Two or four. I've been here, buddy. Apparently. Shit. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh man. No. God damn it. Oh. oh. Get fucking juked, bitch! Get absolutely dodged. Definitely the last level. I guarantee this, this is the end game right here. That's 204. We've been there already. 203. 203 is... Ah, oh, okay. I got, I got 203 already. Jesus. 210. Did it already. 209. Here we go. We got 208. Oh! Whoa! Okay. 208. Not to go in there. 209. All right. Chat. I'll be, I don't know. I don't fucking know. Chat. I'll be honest. I have no fucking idea. <gasps> yes. What are you yes. Inside? It's open. It's open. Where's the monster? I can't tell. Where's the monster? There. All right, we got we gotta go back to the living room now. That was right here, right? Now I gotta fucking find the living room. God damn it! Two twelve. Yep. Here we go. Huh? One more? Oh shit! I thought I thought I had it unlocked, man. Yes. Oh, yeah, I know, right? I'm, I'm, I'm hoping not to die. Finally. 
Yeah, her stamina is great. It was her stamina game is in insane. Her stamina game. Do you don't fuck around? That was intense. I hate chase se sequences, but chase sequences plus puzzle. Oh my god, my worst nightmare when it comes to games. <laughs> Absolutely hate it because my brain is trying to think, but also I'm trying to not fucking die. Right? And I'm trying to remember where I've already been. Oh, it's the worst. I'd rather just deal with a chase sequence, no puzzle, you know? At approximately 1 p.m. on the 12th, pop popular graffiti artist C.B. Maya Ako Hindenburg was found collapsed on the ground of the apartment building in Kenstad. She was pronounced dead at the hospital. Yeah, they're not fun because you're just you're just in a panic the whole time. <laughs> you're just in a stress. Oh my God, I've been here for a year and a half. Huh? I've been in this hell for a year and a half. This. I want to show the hidden side of girls, their impulses, their urges. What are you hiding inside? Don't worry about what people. Yeah, you fucking asshole. She did notice me. She did notice us. And you made her kill yourself. Great. You made her kill herself, and she did notice us. You just had to flip the page one more time. Okay, you would, you would have figured it all out. Yeah, Anita has been living through this hell for like a year and a half. My, like, I don't know what my, I don't know what I got to do to have Maya forgive me, but... I feel like that, that, that's, that's the vibe I'm getting, convinced that, that she was either gay or bi. Because she was pregnant. She did get pregnant, so how did that happen, you know? I feel like our character, though, is definitely is definitely gay and had a crush on Amelie. Had a crush on her. He's not going to waste his WrestleMania spot as a ref. Yeah, it seems, like, it seems like our character had a crush on Maya, was upset that Maya never noticed her. And when Maya noticed Amelie, she got jealous and thought she was trying to take Amelie away from her and ended up bullying Maya to suicide. That seems like the whole story. And the reason why our character is so fucked up is because our character seems like our brother died because of our mother and her our, our, her boyfriend. So we have a shit little trauma too. And our mother hated us. So I think now, I think I now when she dies, I'm staying dead. No matter what anyone has said, I didn't listen, Anita. But you and Maya, <laughs> both of you did see me. I should have figured that out sooner. Anita, wait. Where are you right now? Thank you, Holly. You were always... Imagine this was all in her head. Oh. Let's go shopping tomorrow. We can talk, just the two of us. Tell each other everything that's on our minds. Don't go, Anita. Please don't leave me. She was forgiven. She almost swan time bombed again. 
She almost did a swanton right up the top. It's a my it's Maya's message. I am here for you, Anita. So I wonder what what was it that she found? You know what I mean? Like how uh, uh, um, Maya kept saying, "Find it, find it." What was it that she found? Like did she like did she just have to find that like her guilt or something like what was she had to find? Need only themselves to survive. Those who betray themselves to fit into a group. Like did she did, did she just have to accept it with herself that she caused Maya's death or something? Like that? She had to find the connection, right? Yeah, yeah. I just want someone to understand me. For those I love. Because she finally realized that she was being seen by Maya, like she was noticed. Eighteen-year-old me. Yeah, it, 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 well, it feels it feels it feels like it was a a mixture of a love story and a mixture of like definitely dealing with trauma for sure. A lot of trauma. A lot of trauma. It was all right. It was all right. It had some scares. The story though, the story is definitely not for me. Hundred percent. Like this whole story, definitely not for me. Like but probably because I'm like not like depressed like that. You know what I mean? Like it's definitely not my type of story. Definitely very depressing for sure. Um, but yeah, I mean it, it, it's it's cool. It, it was a beautiful looking game, but definitely not for me. This is the game. This was a, this is a full game. Silent Hill Two is completely different. The other Silent Hill game also different. No, this is the game. This is a this is a brand new game. The fucking demo. It's a demo with a fucking credit scene. Out of ten, like it's a seven out of ten for me. Seven out of ten. I'm put it this way. I'm very hopeful for the next silent for the next ones like i'm very hopeful for the the other silent hill game and the remake like yeah it's a deep message game exactly like there's deep there's a deep message behind the game the message is not for me though you know what i mean the message is just not for me but like se seven out of ten that whole that whole ending chase sequence though i wish it was i wish it was done better like i wish it uh sort of gave you a direction of, of like where you were going i feel like the phone flickering was pretty much letting you know you're near an item but it, i wish i was able to like look around a little bit more rather than just constantly running you know? <laughs> who wants to see the swan on loki bro we saw the swan like four times it wouldn't it wouldn't let her uh get away but anyways uh, round of applause for a complete a completed game. Great job to the devs. Uh, game looked beautiful. Game played great. Had some scares. I look forward to seeing the other Silent Hill games. But yeah, this story wasn't for me though. I hope that the next Silent Hill game, the other one that's coming out, the main, the big one, I hope that one is uh, has a better story than this. But uh, honestly, for what it's for what it is, the short message, um, it did its thing. You know. Yeah. Well. Well. There it is. Wrap it up. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Yes. Noted. All right. How many, how many chapters were that? Three chapters. Okay. Yeah, I feel like they're going to add trophies. When they do, I'll reinstall it. But that was a good game.